Let's be clear. Start off. One anti-Semite in the party is one anti-Semite too many. And uh, when I became leader of the party, some complaints were received. I asked Shami Chakrabarti to undertake a review of all this, which she did. She made a number of recommendations on processes which were not implemented quickly enough. Uh, under Jenny Formby's period as General Secretary in 2018, much more progress was made very quickly. But the numbers have been exaggerated in my view. The public perception in an opinion poll last year was that one third of all Labour Party members were somehow or other under suspicion of anti-Semitism. The reality is it was 0.3% of party members had a case against them which had to be put through the process. And so I think it's clear that we do not accept I do not accept, Keir Starmer does not accept, none of us accept anti-Semitism in any form whatsoever in our party. I did everything I could to make sure a process was put in place and cases were dealt with quickly. And as the report acknowledges, in the latter stages, the process had speeded up, more cases were dealt with, where necessary people were expelled from the party, but also I think we could and should have made more progress on the education process, because I do think education into the hurt caused to Jewish people by allegations of anti-Semitism, by anti-Semitic tropes and tweets and messages, is deep and horrible, and I'm very sorry for any people that were hurt as a result of that, because I want to see, like everybody else does in the Labour Party, anti-Semitism completely ended. What I said today was that anti-Semitism is unacceptable in any form. What I said was... You told me it was exaggerated. I Your said the said number... It was I said, overstated. What I said was the numbers of cases in the public perception had become overstated. The existence of the problem I fully acknowledge, which is why I took action to end the problem in the party by introducing a process to get anti-Semites out of the party. No, I'm not part of the problem. The problem is anti-Semitism historically, anti-Semitism in the presence, and the fear that many people have of being under attack at their synagogue, or indeed mosques, temples, and lots of other places within our society. We need to tackle racism in every conceivable form within our society.